Since the beginning of recorded history, cork has been part of the human experience. As far back as 3000 BC, cork was being used for fishing tackle and for sealing vessels holding water, wine, and precious oils. But outside of our knowledge about its uses, what do we really know about the who, what, where, and how of cork? In this video, we're going to tell you the fantastic story of cork and about an organization working to save the forests that produce this unique, renewable, and amazing material. Cork comes from a tree. The cork oak, or Quercus suber, as its Latin-speaking friends call it. It is native to forests in seven countries around the Mediterranean basin. Portugal, Spain, France, Italy, Morocco, Tunisia, and Algeria. These forests cover nearly 7 million acres. What makes the cork oak unique is that it's the only tree in the world that can have its bark removed, causing no harm to the tree. The bark is hand harvested by skilled craftsmen and made into thousands of products. After the harvest, the cork oak regrows its bark and can be reharvested every nine years. The trees are not cut down and live up to 250 years. Because the trees are not cut down and the bark grows back, Cork harvesting is considered the most environmental and sustainable forestry practice. The more we use cork, the healthier the forests remain. These majestic trees not only provide cork, but also make up one of the world's most important forest regions. Cork forests are host to 25,000 species of plants, animals, and insects that live nowhere else on our planet. Millions of birds migrate from Northern Europe and alight here for their winter home. The most endangered feline, the Iberian lynx, can also be found here. Cork forests provide a livelihood for thousands, produce vast amounts of oxygen, absorb over 20 million tons of CO2 each year, and keep 7 million acres from becoming desert. Today, synthetic materials are replacing more and more the products that have traditionally been made with natural cork. These synthetic products may be cheaper to make, but they come at a much higher cost the health of our planet. In most cases, these synthetic products are made from petrochemicals, are not sustainably sourced, recycled, or biodegradable. They create vast amounts of greenhouse gases, require large amounts of energy to produce and pose health risks to our planet. With lessening demand for natural cork, other tree species such as pine and eucalyptus are being planted. These varieties are not in harmony with cork forest biodiversity and are increasing the risk of desertification. What can you do to help? It's easy. Support companies that use natural cork in their products. Cork is truly an amazing material. It's being used in fashion, aerospace and aviation, industrial products, building materials, flooring, and various household products. Each time you buy a product made from cork, or open a bottle of wine closed with natural cork, you are making a conscious choice to help save the cork forests and our planet.